al spotter 6100. Al spotter 6100 is a single phase portable fan cool power source for a capacitor discharge welding of plain and 3D studs 3 to 8 mm diameter, nails and fastens. It enables welding of non-treated or non-oxidized surfaces in steel, stainless steel, galvanized steel, breasts and in particular aluminium. These characteristics highlight Alus Potter 6100 in the automotive sector, illuminating systems, installation and maintenance works. Use precautions. Follow manufacturer's instructions to protect vehicle electronic parts. Disconnect battery negative pole, remove protect electronic carts and cables in the working area, etc. Use proper personal safety means like gloves, protective glasses, etc. as advised in the instruction manual. Preparation of the generator for automotive use. With generator in off position, connect to working cables and prepare the gun to work on aluminium parts. Choose the stud holder M4, stud to be welded and adjust its protrusion to 1 mm by means of the screw. Then block it using the nut. Unscrew nut from the gun, insert the stud holder into the mandarin and push it until the bottom is reached. Then block the nut. Preparation of base material. Clean accurately the part on which you will work and the area where the work clamp is to be fixed. The latter needs to be positioned near the area where you wish to weld. Remove varnish from the working area by using a grinding machine and further clean the area with a pH neutral soap soaked sponge, then dry it off. How to fix work cable? Connect the work socket to the area previously clean, fix it the nearest possible to the working area. Regulation of the generator. The generator is to be regulated according to the table printed on the cover of the machine as well as in the instruction manual. Regulate by adjusting the voltage and pressure knobs on the machine. For studs, regulate to 100 volt with pressure from 3.5 to 4 bar. Spot welding operation. Gently lean the gun on the working point. Press the button. Push slowly the gun until you get the automatic striking of the discharge. Once the weld is done, pull the gun out perpendicularly to the stud. According to the damaged area, fix more M4 studs in order to optimize the pulling operation. Preparation of the alupool system with standard 3-pin multi-hook. Before starting the pulling operation, screw the proper rings to the spotted pins. Set alupool system ready for pulling by inserting the multi-hook pins into the washers. Pulling operation. 
In case there are no particular instructions from the vehicle manufacturer, warm the area until the material where you work starts to expand. Medium temperature around 150 to 100 degrees centigrade. Do this in the least time possible. Exert a progressive pulling on the working area. To avoid the upsetting of the damaged area, space out the pulling operation by slightly hitting the area around the fixed stud with a rubber or aluminium hammer. Pull beyond the origin level and keep the area under traction until it is cool. Once cooled, proceed with the gradual loosening of the pulling hook. Removal of the studs. Remove the fixed studs from the metal sheet by use of a grinding machine. Avoid to strap the studs as this may cause holes on the sheet. Optional. The following optional are available. Multi hooks with 4, 6, 8, 10 pins and the accessory kit for kit telepool system which contains stud holders and various types of screws.